Alright, so I've got my mini birch box here. Um, it came while I was gone, so I haven't cracked into it yet. Honestly, I've been so busy that I really have no idea what's in here. Um, so it will kind of be like a surprise unboxing kind of review. But uh, if you haven't seen the birch boxes, they come in these little cardboard boxes around the original box they send you. Alright, so May is all about good form, um, basically just having good, I guess, design and organization. Um, it's May, I'm surprised they don't have any cleaning, but uh, we will see what we got here. Um, right off the bat, they have a set of cards. Um, this is kind of their, uh, everybody is getting one of these, so this is kind of, I think, promoting their ACES uh, VIP program, and uh, <clears throat> basically their VIP program is if you spend a certain amount of money, you become VIP status, and I think it's free shipping for life. Um, I can't remember all the other perks that are in there. They say that you may get exclusive items and stuff like that. I'm considered one of the... Um, ACE VIP members for the next year, so um, I'll t show you guys if I end up getting anything exciting. Alright, so next, uh, we'll see what's inside here. I guess these are breath crystals. Yeah, they're effervescent breath treatment. Um, they're minty, crackling crystals that fight germs and bad breath. Um, basically they're pop rocks. Yeah, so, uh, they have peppermint, honey mint, lemon mint, and spearmint. Um, I'll probably give these a try. Um, Especially sometimes I eat healthy food at work that makes my breath not taste so or smell so fresh. So um, I'll try some of these and uh, hopefully they do the job. So the next is Dr. Dewey Lip Cure. It's this itty bitty tiny bottle. Um, it's probably, yeah, it's not even a tenth of an ounce. 2.5 grams to be exact, but um, it's a lip balm, which I do like better than like chapstick and stuff like that, just because it goes on matte. Uh, so we'll see, we'll see how this works. Actually, my lips are kind of dry, so I might as well try it out now. I mean, it's nothing special. It's like every other lip balm I've probably ever used. Um, but I'll throw this in my bag, and I'll probably go through this in about a week. Uh, it's really dry out here now. So, um, anyways, this will do its job, but probably won't buy the full size. I guess this is History's Day Parfum, uh, 1899. So that's kind of cool that the sample comes in a little box like this. I guess it makes it feel more unique than a standard sample that you're going to get. But uh, let's see how it smells. I'm not sure if I like it. It's. Uh, It's a lot more subtle than I would think. Um, it's got a lot of spice, but uh, beyond that, it's, it's pretty, a little too subtle for about how much I just sprayed on myself. But I will wear it, and I will see if I like it. Probably not. This is Rehab London 
and it's called Daily Scrub Up. It's an exfoliant. Um, doesn't say if it's for your face or anything like that, just for wherever on your body. I have a ton of these samples still left. I just haven't had a chance to use them because I don't really find a really good reason to use them all the time. So uh, I'll try it out. And then, hey. Uh, so next we have the Roosevelt Supply uh, canvas zipper case. This is the same company that. Um, if you saw some of my earlier boxes, they sent the lifestyle items um, out. This is actually kind of nice. Um, it's got the little Roosevelt Supply logo right there. But um, yeah, this is kind of nice. Uh, probably would be good for me to throw like chargers and cables when I travel because, like I said, I've been gone for like the last 10 days. And if I had been able to put it all in a little pouch like this, I probably would have found everything that I needed right away rather than dumping all my bags to find the one cable uh, that I was looking for. So, I mean, it's a canvas bag. It's made pretty nice. It's got a few leather accents like on the zipper here. Um, and it's, it's decent sized. Um, so this is actually one of the few lifestyle items that I've gotten lately that I'll probably use regularly. So it's just basically a poster that they sent out. Um, I actually made a post, post that at work um, for a short bit and change up my my office space. Yeah, so the this right here tells you what the ACES program is. Uh, it is you earn 500 birch box points within one calendar year, and you'll have a spot on the ACES VIP list. Um, it's free shipping, grooming consultations, bonus samples, and more. Um, and then you can look on their website, birchbox.com slash ACES, if you want to know more about that. But anyways, this is my box. Um, let's see, I spent $20 on it. I got a decent sized cologne sample, um, even though I may not like this. This is probably about a month's worth of cologne for me. Uh, got this that I'll probably use for a week. Got some cards, which yeah, I could have picked these up down at the store for like a buck. But I mean, they sent them to everybody for free. This I probably would have found something similar for about 10 bucks. Uh, and then also the little uh, breath fresheners. I mean, this is probably sitting right at being worth $20 to me. Um, granted, that doesn't include any shipping. That would be like if I was to go out to the store myself. Um, so basically, I'm saving money for the convenience of somebody picking all these items out for me. Anyways, uh, I am happy with the box, mainly because I didn't know that I was getting this, and this happens to be something that I was actually going to go out and buy today. So uh, overall, uh, decently happy with the Birch box, a lot better than some of the boxes that I've been getting before. Um, and uh, I think I will continue to subscribe. All right, thanks for watching, guys. If you want to watch any of my other Birchbox unboxings, you can check out the playlist that I made for Birchbox. Uh, I also have a ton of other subscription boxes out there. I just did a Bombfell one. I've got Trunk Club, 5-4, uh, Bespoke Post. Um, those are the ones that I got right now. If you guys want to see me do a subscription box for something else, uh, then you can just leave a comment below and I will try to see if I can get a box of that. Uh, also, it has to be worth my money. I spend my own money on it. I don't ask them to send me a free box because then what's the point of me doing a biased review and then they know somebody's doing a review on their stuff so they may bump it up a little bit. So, anyways, <clears throat> this is everything within my box and thanks for watching.